Hey everybody, Julia Stock, Business Revolutionary with Be Astute. Um, you may have spent the last year wading through our A to Z of business vocab, um, which we got a lot of very positive comments about. So we're back with a new A to Z of business artifacts. Um, this could get very random very quickly. Um, and it is because we're starting with A for abacus. This is how my brain works. Um, this is not about using outdated technology, but more around the importance of using counting machines um, and really keeping on top of how you're earning your money, where you're earning your money. Um, it's amazing the number of business owners I meet who are scared of their finance system. They pay a lot of money to a bookkeeper or a VA to process their invoices, reconcile everything. And so they never really get that confidence in what buttons to press to actually spit out the answers in order to understand what they're spending their money on and potentially whether or not they're charging the right amount. So while the abacus might be the wrong thing, there is nothing wrong with ancient technology. Um, actually, you know, I use the calculator app on my phone all the time. Um, in terms of keeping a track of what we're earning and how we're earning it. Um, it's good to be using these finance systems, but they're not really designed for business owners. They're designed for accountants, by accountants. So it's not really surprising that so many business owners really struggle with them. They're written in language we don't really understand. They're spitting out a load of reports that aren't relevant. Um, and so it's easy to go, la, 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 let's stick my head in a bucket of sand. Everything will be fine. Um, my accountant tells me what to do. The reality is you're the business owner. It's your responsibility to know what's going on. You need that finance information in real time. You need to know what you're earning, what you're spending. And that means you do have a responsibility to understand where you can find out that information. But also, especially if you're outsourcing it to somebody else, how do you know it's right? Um, again, I was with a business owner a couple of days ago. We were looking at it, he never looks at it normally, and he spotted a mistake instantaneously in terms of rent payments. He's going, that doesn't make any sense. Well, that could have gone through into his statutory accounts, um, declarations into government, all kinds of stuff that's wrong and unless you're putting in the time and effort to be looking at this stuff you can't say that you know it's wrong so how can you hold your accountant to account and make sure that they're doing their job right so the abacus might be the wrong business artifact but it's probably quite a good stress thing to have on your desk um but a calculator a spreadsheet a piece of paper pressing some buttons, learning what buttons to press on your finance system definitely will reduce those sleepless nights. If you want to know more in terms of getting your head around this stuff, it's a great conversation. I'd love to have a chat with you about it. So A for Abacus. Thank you very much.